you already know. So we got some breaking news coming out of hip hop, and that is music mogul, billionaire, iconic rap rapper, Jay-Z, aka Hove, aka Jigga, so on and so forth, has been accused of graping a girl underage with sean p diddy combs aka puff daddy aka diddy aka love you already know but i'm reading this article from the new york post a little bit of it hip-hop legend jay-z has been accused of allegedly graping underage girl with sean diddy combs at a vma party in new york two decades ago what a bombshell lawsuit claims. The alleged victim, only identified as Jane Doe, leveled the disturbing allegations with a newly filed civil lawsuit filed with the Southern District of New York on Sunday. The complaint was originally filed in October against Combs, but has since been amended to include Jay-Z, who, whose real name is Sean Carter. Carter, though, lashed out at the allegations last Sunday, claiming in a statement with the alleged victim lawyer refiled the complaint only after allegedly trying to blackmail him first. Jay-Z released a statement that says, quote, my lawyer received a blackmail attempt called a demand letter from a lawyer named Tony. What he had calculated was that the nature of these allegations and the public scrutiny will make me want to settle. No, sir, it had the opposite effect. It made me want to expose you for the fraud you are in a very public fashion, so no, I will not give you one red penny. These allegations are so heinous in nature that I implore you to file a criminal complaint, not a civil one. Whomever you, whomever would commit such a crime against a minor should be locked away. Would you not agree? And the statement goes on, so on and so forth. Look, you hear stuff all the time. Uh, There's always been these rumors about Jay-Z. I don't know. You know, a lot of a lot of times stuff be conspiracies, conspiracy theories. Sometimes the stuff be true. I'm going to say this. Innocent and prove, until proven guilty. We live in a country that anybody can say anything about anyone at any time, file a lawsuit, so on and so forth. And we always are quick to run to conclusions without any evidence. Only in America, when it comes to people that look like Jay-Z, when you hear an allegation come out, a lot of times you you hear a lot of slander immediately where what, which, what is going on right now. But you got the, ev the evidence has to, has to play itself. Now with Diddy, with Diddy going on with the feds, even with that, there was a lot of people out there, including myself, that was like, okay, well, we gotta, gotta see some evidence. And everyone in this country is due to a fair trial, but we don't know. I mean, I'm sure Jay-Z, he got a dream team of lawyers. We don't know who's suing. We don't know what kind of lawyers they got. All of this can can make a difference. But like I said, I know I will tell you that before you believe someone is guilty, at least get the at least see the evidence first. But I just want to get my quick thoughts about it. Tell me what y'all think.